ten times Naruto outsmarted the villain. Despite his lack of book smarts, Naruto seems to have a knack for coming up with the perfect strategy in the middle of a fight. After failing the graduation exam several times, Naruto wasn't exactly known for his brains. He was not a good student. Naruto was typically considered to be something of an idiot. Everyone underestimated his skills and intelligence. In one night, he managed to master a forbidden jutsu he learned from a stolen scroll. That one action changed everything for Naruto. He soon began to show just how incredibly brilliant he could be. Naruto seems to have a knack for coming up with the perfect strategy in the middle of a fight. Naruto has his own moments of brilliance, and that brilliance usually only comes out during a fight. 10 times Naruto outsmarted the villain. Despite his lack of book smarts, Naruto seems to have a knack for coming up with the perfect strategy in the middle of a fight. After failing the graduation exam several times, Naruto wasn't exactly known for his brains. He was not a good student. Naruto was typically considered to be something of an idiot. Everyone underestimated his skills and intelligence. In one night, he managed to master a forbidden jutsu he learned from a stolen scroll. That one action changed everything for Naruto. He soon began to show just how incredibly brilliant he could be. Naruto seems to have a knack for coming up with the perfect strategy in the middle of a fight. Naruto has his own moments of brilliance, and that brilliance usually only comes out during a fight. 9. When he was able to reason with Itachi. Naruto stumbled upon Itachi on accident. He knew that taking down the enemy ninja would put him in contact with his best friend. Itachi was easily able to overpower the younger ninja. Itachi began to interrogate Naruto's relationship with Sasuke. Itachi was incredibly interested as to why Naruto was so concerned with his younger brother. Naruto was able to say the right words. He was able to escape Itachi with little damage. Though Naruto didn't understand the interaction at the time, he managed to walk away from an encounter with Itachi with almost no damage done to his mind or body. 8. When he used Raisingan against Kabuto. Kabuto was an older, more experienced ninja. He was after the future fifth Hokage, Tsunade, when Naruto got in his way. It was surprising how skilled Naruto seemed to be as he blocked the attacks of the better trained Kabuto. He was able to use the Raisingan for the first time during his fight with Kabuto. He was only able to create the Raisingan by utilizing the clone jutsu he had already learned. Tsunade was amazed that Naruto had mastered such a difficult jutsu. 7. When Naruto realizes Abito's weakness. After Abito becomes the Ten Tails, he seems to be unstoppable. He instantly becomes one of the most powerful villains Naruto has ever faced. Naruto realizes that the use of Senjutsu can stop Abito. He teams up with Sasuke to stop Abito. When they manage to weaken Abito, Naruto gets a chance to reason with the enemy. Abito initially tries to resist Naruto's words, but Naruto is eventually able to reason with his father's former student. Naruto's quick thinking allows him to defeat Abito. 6. When Gara transformed his entire life after an encounter with Naruto. Gara came across as dangerous and unstable from his introduction. After Gara took out Sasuke and Sakura, Naruto was the only member of their team left to defeat him. At the time, people were still questioning Naruto's skills. No one thought he had the ability to take on someone as strong as Gara. Naruto managed to not only win but completely change Gara's outlook on life. Naruto managed to make a lifelong impact and friend when he talked to Gara. 5. When Naruto manages to change Nagato's mind. Nagato, operating under the name Pain, was an incredibly dangerous enemy. 
He was responsible for killing Jiraiya, and almost killing Kakashi. Naruto spent a lot of time being angry for pain and the problems he caused. When Naruto finally approaches Nagato, the two have a heart-to-heart. -heart. Naruto manages to reason with Nagato and causes him to rethink everything. As a result, Nagato reverses some of the problems he caused and brings Kakashi back to life. 4. When Naruto knows just how to stop Sasuke. Naruto had tried and failed to bring Sasuke back to the village. When they find themselves back at the Valley of the End, they will be fighting for the fate of the world. Naruto has never been able to reason with Sasuke before. Naruto realizes that the only way to stop Sasuke is to force him to listen. Naruto sacrifices one of his arms. He is finally able to have a conversation with Sasuke. He manages to make Sasuke see the error of her ways. 3. When Naruto manages to outsmart Sabuza. Sabuza is dangerous and deadly. The younger members of Team 7 are no match for the experienced ninja. When Zabuza manages to capture Kakashi, the rest of the team stand no chance to defeat Zabuza without the most powerful member of their team. Naruto comes up with a plan to help free Kakashi. Naruto solely comes up with the idea of getting Sasuke to throw two weapons. Concealing one in the shadow of the other. This strategy is the first time Naruto shows just how brilliant he can be. 2. When Naruto manages to stop Niji. Niji's skills and smarts are praised by just about everyone who meets him. When Naruto is forced to face him during the Chunin exams, all the spectators assume Naruto stands no chance in the fight. Niji fully believes he will be able to dominate in the fight. For a little while, it looks like Naruto will lose. Naruto somehow manages to come up with the ideal strategy to stop his opponent. Naruto creates some clones, hides underground, and manages to land a punch on Niji. This attack comes after Niji has shown his impressive skills. 1. When Naruto manages to befriend Kurama. For centuries, Kurama was an evil beast. Shortly before the birth of Naruto, he destroyed the village. He was partially the reason Naruto was an orphan. He was the reason Naruto was treated so badly by the other villagers. Somehow, Naruto manages to befriend the monster. Naruto is able to change the mindset of someone much older than himself. Kurama goes from being trapped inside Naruto to truly regarding Naruto as a friend. It highlights Naruto's ability to speak to an enemy and change them.